Hello everyone. Today we will be discussing about Trafficking in Person, Prevention, Care and Rehabilitation Bill 2021 by Ministry of Women and Child Development. The main aim of this bill is that first one, prevention of trafficking in children, women and transgender. Earlier in 2018, there was another bill regarding the human trafficking and in that bill, there was no discussion about trafficking of transgenders. But in this bill of 2021, there, are, there is a discussion about trafficking of transgenders as well. Second point is that care, protection and rehabilitation of the victim. And third is about the prosecution of offenders. So these are the main aim of the trafficking in person, prevention, care and rehabilitation bill 2021. And you have to note that Article 23 is the article of the Constitution which is speaking about human trafficking, okay, which deals with prohibition, trafficking of persons, okay. So, Article 23 is the article of the Constitution which is discussing about human trafficking. You have to note that point also. Then, let us see the details of the 2021 bill. First one is the punishment. In that, there are two kinds of punishment. First one is that imprisonment, which is simple imprisonment along with fine. In that, minimum imprisonment will be for 7 years and which may extend up to 10 years along with that 5 lakhs rupees fine. Okay. And imprisonment for life is also there, which will be given in case of trafficking of child as well as more than one child. Okay. And this is regarding the imprisonment and compared to the 2018 bill, the punishment has become more stringent in 2021 bill. Okay. And this bill extends also to citizens who are Indian citizens who are residing in India as well as outside India and also to foreign nationals or stateless person residing in India. Okay. So this bill extends to Indian citizen who are residing in India as well as outside India and foreign nationals or stateless person who is residing in India. Okay. And also aircraft or ships carrying Indian officers and Indian aircraft or shipping company which is getting involved in the human trafficking also will be coming under this bill. Then government offices as offenders will be extending also to Defense personnel, government servants, paramedical staff and anyone in the position of authority. Okay, so all these persons will also come under the provision of the 2021 bill. Okay, then if person, if a person through human trafficking has made some income and that income they have utilized for buying some kind of property, that property will be forfeited by the government. Okay, any property which is bought using the income created through the human trafficking will be forfeited by the government. That is also another important point. Okay. Then regarding the investigation agency, NIA is the investigating agency or nodal investigating agency. NIA means national investigating agency and it is said that this will be a burden on the NIA because already there is a lot of issues to be solved by the NIA. There is a lot of problems assigned on NIA. So along with that human trafficking is also assigning to NIA will be a lot of burden on the NIA. And it is said that it will be good if human trafficking cases involving outside borders, I mean international borders are given to NIA and the human trafficking cases which is dealing with the local issues are given to local agencies or federal agencies okay and next is about national anti-human trafficking committee there will be a national anti-human trafficking committee set up and the chair for that national anti-human trafficking committee will be home secretary and co-chair will be secretary of women and child development ministry and in the 2018 there was a clause that a victim should be to be said uh, that as a human trafficking victim 
the victim should be transported from one place to another okay but in this case this clause has been removed now in the 2000 according to the 2021 bill it is not necessary that the victim should be transported from one place to another to be considered as a victim of human trafficking okay so this is also a new provisions wrote under the 2021 bill okay so these are all the main provisions or main points of the trafficking in person prevention care and rehabilitation bill 2021 okay so study this bill this is very important for the exam all the provisions are very important so that's all thank you